Imagine the dose. This is why you and I know when you go to a doctor, what does he write for you if you are unwell? Something known as a prescription. Why do they call it a prescription? You cannot change it. You cannot alter it. It starts at this time. It ends at that time. And the doctor will tell you, you better make sure you finish the course. The same words are used by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala when it comes to fasting in Ramadan. Ya amanu. O you who believe. Do you consider yourself a believer? If the answer is yes, listen carefully. The one who made you is talking to you. He is addressing you. Yes, you. He is saying, O you who believe. Fasting has been written, prescribed. Notice the wording, kutiba. Fasting has been prescribed upon you, just like it was prescribed upon those before you. They had different prescriptions. Their antibiotic was slightly different. Yours is slightly different, but it is also fasting. Fasting meaning to abstain from certain things that you like a lot. What do you love? You love your food. Wow, mashallah. Allah says, stay away from it for a while. We'll help you. We'll help you dedicate. You, what else do you love? Your spouse. Allah says, stay away from her or for, from him for a little while. We'll give you something you love. Subhanallah. You'll appreciate what you have. Amazing. Look at the prescription. When the doctor tells you stay away from that which is high in cholesterol, we make sure like gospel we follow it. Because we don't want to have a blood test showing us that the cholesterol is a little bit high. Similarly, you have spiritual cholesterol that affects you. And Allah has given us spiritual remedy for that. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us. It is a prescription prescribed. And guess what he says about the course? He says, make sure you finish the course. Do you want to hear the verse? Allah Akbar. Allah says, make sure you finish in order that you may finish the idda. What is an idda? It is a prescribed time, the course. If you have less, you may not achieve. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us and may he grant us goodness.